Hello everyone, it is King Tip from the Eternal Paradox. And today I have great, 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 great regrets. The Iron Series premiere extravaganza of the 23 minute epic was not saved. I looked, we ended in 1444, or four, I mean, sorry, 1455, which is exactly 11 years from now. So, I'm going to pause the recording, work up to there, and basically almost do the same thing. Except maybe not become most friends in England, start declaring war more often, or I mean really quickly trying to gain Munster. Like really, really, really quickly I'm talking about. So uh, before England warns us. <clears throat> so uh, yeah, I'll be playing, I'll come with you whenever we conquer a province, ally, or if England does anything, basically when anything super, super important happens, I'm not going to be checking in that much. So, I'll be right, alright, I'm back, and we have our fourth, uh, army unit, which means England hasn't warned us yet, so we're going to declare war on Munster. Oh. Well, that's pretty bad, I thought we started with a... With a cast a spell on, but I guess we're only do back to the Battle Claim. So this was a false alarm. Uh, hopefully, England doesn't uh, warn us. Because if they warn us and we attack someone else, they'll now have to attack us too. So it's basically a race against time. Oh! No! There's a new pulp! No, I'm just kidding. We have been warned! And our claim was 85% done on Munster. We cannot declare war on any country without England stepping in to stop us. So, I guess we'll just play now. Dang it, that was really depressing. Almost there, too. Now I'm going to fabricate the claim for nothing. And all of them hate me, so I can't, like, diplomatically do anything. So maybe they're still in the 100 years of war. We need an ally. I wonder if Steel would be an ally. Maybe Burgundy? No, we tried Burgundy last time. Scotland. Hey, Scotland. I'd like to ally with you. They're hostile with us. What? Why are you hostile with me? Alright, we're going to approve relations with Scotland and try to get an alliance with them. And then when we do, or if we do, then I will try attacking these guys even though we've been warned. Because I have a feeling that we'll just have a power to fight back even a little bit while they're still in the 100 years war. So I'll be back when something happens. Alright, I just discovered something good. Kanak has been discovered fabricating a claim on Mitzvah, which means if they declare war on us. If they declare war on us, and then we beat them back, we can still take it, because England won't join in against us in the defensive war, or only if we attack someone else, then they'll join in against us. If you get what I'm saying, this is really, really good. Hey guys, I'm back. Three years until where we left off last time. We just, uh, Scotland just became neutral with us. Because they just rivaled England as we did. And they went out to the alliance, we just got a royal marriage. Also, King of Burgundy just died. So now Austria owns all of that. Owns all of that. Owns all of that. It's really good. We're going to have a really good ally here. I'll let you guys see it. Boom. Perfect! Scotland is now allied. And we will help. If they ever declare war on England by ruining and teaching me, which I never protect. And also, we're trying to build up a fleet of boats. In fact, once we get to 50 coins, I'll probably start building some heavies. Well, I'll be right back probably when we left off last time. The Pope just ordered a crusade against the Ottomans. We didn't know right before 
these four huts, the Pope had just ordered a crusade on the Ottomans and lost. And they just took out the Byzantines. I did not know what the Pope was thinking. But okay. Okay, we're getting a new technology. And I think it's pretty close to the time where we left off. We're going to start keeping you guys in and everything. So right now, France won the war. Oh, who's this? The Ottomans are sieging Austria. Here, wow. Okay, but also Sweden won its independence. Took Jamaatland from Norway. Took uh, Holland from Denmark. And Sweden, I mean Scotland, took uh, Orkney from uh, Norway. Because Sweden was, I mean Scotland was in World War II. And now Connacht is attacking Munster. Which I don't want, because I want to attack both of them and take both of their provinces. We are still warned to win. We are warned 65, so 10 years. We can get some more technology. We need to surpass England. So we right now are at military technology 5. Are they still at 4? They're still at 3. So our military technology completely surpasses England. England hates us. Guaranteeing the independence of Connacht? They're gonna make him into a vassal! To build some more people, or else they're gonna crush by England. Vortex, which means our first idea group, which will be quality. Quality is very, very, very good for us at least. We need our troops to be very good. I guess also quantity will be next, because we do need a lot of people on this line. And the next one will be uh. Probably exploration, so we can go to set up colonies. We took Portugal, took Casablanca. England broke their alliance with the Papal State. See anything else happening? That's not. These guys are still patrolling. Whoa, okay, do we need it? Virgin. I say we put them. I don't know if we're going to be going into any war too quickly, right? Gain, conquest, possibility. Oh, oh gosh. Oh no. So now we can't attack. We can't attack anyone on our island anymore. Not even after that, because even is guaranteed for not. Oh my gosh. Everything's going downhill. Very, very quickly. Hmm. I'd very much like to attack them. But I'm warned and you want to recover Normandy? England wants to take back Normandy. Good luck with that, buddy. But they ride horse? Yeah. I like to rival. Scotland is your rival? Wow. Scotland, by the way.
Sorry. Wow, I just walked out. Alright, we rule. Okay, to prestige, and that puts us back to the positive for prestige. France has rivaled Austria and Castile. So they're in a war to uh to attack them away to our warnings up. And they'd still jump to the war because they're guaranteeing could knocked till fourteen seventy. They're allied with Austria, Denmark, and Portugal. Those are guys I do not want to get to a mess with. on a better track to form an island than I am. Ugh. The rocks have been completely... Oh wait, no. The robots have stuck down here too. Is the boy fighting for the same reason? Provence was trying to take Siena. Alright guys, that's it for this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. Wine's from Norway, heck yeah! Sweet! You know what? Just because of that, I'm going to extend the episode. We extend the episode to the extent we're going to declare war cannot. Right after I do this. A royal marriage to Norway, of course. As long as you join arms against England. So if we declare war against Kanak, take Munster. Neither of them would join the war? Norway? But you could creep England, I bet. You 
and Scotland combined, and me? Come on. Either of you will join? Alright. Maybe after I've been, after the war falls off and after we're not guaranteed. But yeah, that's been it for this episode. It's been Geek Tip. Signing out.